first of all, thanks for giving us five minutes just to talk about something real briefly. Um, we're, what we're happy to talk about, oh, that's just the introductory slide, is uh, a LabVIEW community edition to help support the community. So this is NI's part of trying to help support the community. So this will, this is our first public announcement. So we chose GDevCon as the first place that we were gonna publicly talk about this. That was pretty intentional. Um, what this is is a completely free version. It has no watermarks on it. It has had no restrictions on it. Um, it is a version of the LabVIEW professional development system, so it includes all the functionality that's included in that um, for non-commercial um, and non-academic usage. Uh, this will be available from our website shortly, and the re this is a result of a lot of people in this room, so I wanted to first of all say thank you to everybody who took time um, earlier this year and during NI Week to give video testimonials of what you would do with LabVIEW if we had a better way of engaging with the community. Uh, those video testimonials were a big part of actually convincing NI uh, that we needed to do more than what we'd been doing in the past. And so thank you very much. That's part of how we got here. Um, so we want to know what you'd be doing with it. So we have our own bit.ly link. This is a survey. We'd love to hear your feedback on how you'll use this version of LabVIEW. Um, what you do with it, who you'll talk to about it, because we want to advertise, we want to promote the work that you do with this community edition. What will you do to help support the community? Um, so let's talk a little bit about timeline. I'll leave this slide up for just a few minutes um, so people can take pictures and know where that link goes. Um, the toolkit, so this product will also include the Lynx toolkit. The Lynx toolkit is what allows um, you to target BeagleBone, Raspberry Pi, and Arduino devices using the LabVIEW development system. So that'll be available. Um, I wanted to be able to say it'll be available today because the engineering team has done what they need to do, but we don't have the web link live yet. So it'll be available in the next week or two. Um, it'll be available through the technical preview program. So if you sign up for the technology preview program, you'll see this later in the year in Q4, so a couple weeks away. Uh, you'll see the whole beta program, so the LabVIEW Community Edition beta program will actually be live also in the technical preview program. And then releasing with LabVIEW 2020's release in the early part of next year, so we'll announce it and have a big um, release during NI week. Uh, there'll be the LabVIEW Community Edition, that's the full release, and the LabVIEW NXG Community Edition, so we're going to do it in both LabVIEW and LabVIEW NXG. Um, so you can sign up for it on the technical preview program. Those things will be live um, soon. And you know, if you guys would send us you know, what you want to do with it or send, continue sending us more uh, video testimonials, we'll be happy to promote this. And so, like I said, this is NI's way of trying to help promote this community um, of LabVIEW users. We really appreciate your time and what you do. Um, and we want to be able to advertise it. Nancy has a comment. for you to install wherever you want, as long as it's a non-commercial, non-education, yeah. Now, yeah, so we want you to be able to create you know, whatever you want to build in this thing. So it includes all the functionality of the pro version. You can deploy that either, either as libraries for the rest of the community to use or as executables. Once it's available in the community, people can do whatever, with it whatever they want. So yes, you can develop anything you want as long as you personally are not profiting from that um, and it's not part of some um, research institution, uh, educational institution. So yes, all the functionality that's included in LabVIEW Pro is included in this. It is actually the Pro version, so if you have other modules and toolkits that you want to use, those will all work fine with the Community Edition. We didn't do anything weird to try to circumvent, you know, prevent anything from working with it. Um, it's just the functionality that's included in this free version is everything that's in Pro. So 
So we didn't want to take any more time because I know it's real important for you guys to be able to get to the rest of your session. So if you have other questions, I was going to just tell Nancy not to do that. Um, if you have other questions, you want to come find us. We're available during the breaks or after the session or during dinner. You want to come track us down. Please do. We want to hear everything that you want to do because we want to promote it. Um, but I don't want to take any more time out of your session. So wherever Darren disappeared to, right behind me. Yeah, this is public, so this is our first official announcement. It'll actually be on our website as part of the technical preview program. Well, Daniel and I will probably be working on it during one of the sessions later today, as soon as Austin gets back awake and we can get the website stood up that was supposed to be live. Can you go back to the I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> the logo, that one.